Okay guys, so a while ago I did a video on the 300 decibel train horn you can order. You see a ton of advertisements for it, or even on Amazon now, which really isn't right. But anyway, so when I ordered my first horn, I got it uh, right here in this box. So we'll open it up. Here it is. Here's the horn I sent. So once I ordered this and found out that it was a scam, I researched it and 300, now listen to me, 300 decibels is impossible. It doesn't matter, I didn't order the wrong horn, it's not metric decibels, 300 decibels is completely unachievable. This thing says 600B high 12 volt 510 hertz. 60B is just the tone of the horn. Now I know on the original video I made, there were comments that this is the 110 decibel version. The decibel meter I was using on my phone is inaccurate. I should have ordered the black one. Instead, it's 300 decibels, but still, 300 decibels is impossible. Not even a train horn. I mean, in comparison, a train horn might be 120, 130 decibels. 150 decibels will get you hearing loss. 185 to 200 decibels can cause death and I think the loudest sound ever recorded on earth was 190 decibel volcanic eruption the Krakatoan Volcano I believe uh, Those poor Krakatoan people But anyway, so I went back online and I looked and there was a black version of train horn and uh, So I ordered it and I made sure I got the black 300 decibel version, so I didn't screw it up. Uh, I know it's no such thing, but I wanted to make sure that I got the right one, supposedly. So this is the box it came in, and I'm not quite sure what it says. It, maybe it says 300 decibel train horn, maybe dot, 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 I don't know. So let's open it up. Look at that. Now we got two. So here's one. It says Shenzhen Z 60B high 12 volt 510 hertz, which is exactly the same as what this horn says. Actually, they're the same horns. One has a red housing, one has a black housing. And this other one here, Shenzhen Z 60B low 12 volts. 410 Hertz. So this is essentially what you'd have on a vehicle two horns So you get a bit of a horn tone instead of a single honk hard to explain but it Comes with some uh, Mounting brackets wiring So I'm gonna go ahead and wire this up anyway, I've got the no code boost over here We're gonna put 12 volts to it and just for the heck of it We'll see how many decibels it puts at. All right, guys, so I took this little experiment outside just so I don't freak my dogs out. So I've got the two horns wired together, just the two powers together, two grounds together. The NOCO is ready to administer power. I've got my decibel gauge meter reading here. So let's see what these two horns put out. All right, so there you have it. We're back inside. Another fake ripoff. It says it hit 115 decibels, but I think I made that sound hitting the tailgate of the truck. But while they were blowing, it was around uh, 90 to 100 decibels. It may not be the most accurate sound meter, of course, but if it was 300, I'd probably be dead by now, and you wouldn't see this video. So here they are. Don't buy the 300 decibel horns. They're junk. It's a lie. It's not true. There's no such thing. I've actually even seen an ad out now where they have 400 decibel horns. So don't fall for it. They're completely junk. If you want a really good horn that's loud, has lots of trumpets, lots of air behind it, get, a, get an air horn, get a train horn. Uh, Hornblasters.com has amazing kits, but they're not cheap. These are cheap and they're fake and it's not true. 
there you go guys thanks for watching and i can't stress enough do not buy one i didn't buy the wrong one this isn't a quieter model there's just no such thing as 300 decibels trust me so thanks again for watching guys we'll see you in the next one